one, Master 0063 back for I Wanna Be the Boshi Part 9. Um, and we stopped here because um, oh, well, I was running out of time, and uh, we have this little segment, which um, if I'm going to do, it's obviously going to take me at least a minute to do it. So uh, this is actually quite fun. I, uh, I, I don't actually mind this section, um, despite uh, dying rather quickly there twice. Um, I find this actually quite a lot of fun. Um, it's uh, a lot more fun, I say, than the what than the uh, the uh, equivalents, uh, the equivalent bit on the actual VVV game itself. Um, just because, um, well, um, it seems to be moving. Uh, it seems to move a lot slower, and the patterns are such that they are, you know, a bit uh, easier to dodge. Um, the one on VVV uh, uh, VVV um, in the main game actually um, has a kind of a a, a time. Uh, checkpoint, so that I think it's every uh, five seconds or so. Um, if you're successful, um, you can start from there. So uh, when you start, if you've survived, I don't know, let's say 14 seconds or so, and you got down to 46, um, you wouldn't have to do the whole thing again. Unlike I'm going to die, damn. Um, unlike on this one where the clock resets uh, completely. So uh, yeah, if you died at 46 seconds on your first go, um, the clock would actually uh, start on your next go at 50 seconds because um, that would be the five uh, five second checkpoint bleh, that you uh, that you hit so um, it's a lot more forgiving in that sense um, but um, a lot lot harder to dodge um, in the uh, in the original game um, and the super graviton um, in the uh, little bonus area you get when you when you collect I think all the uh, sh 20 shiny trinkets um, that's kind of got a little time trial element, obviously, to it. You see how long you can survive, and uh, yeah, that is uh, uh, bloody difficult um, <laughs> to survive for any particular length of time. So, um, uh, yeah, I find this one um, far less uh, irritating. And of course, coming into the VV stop lagging, uh, coming into the VV VV V one, I'd actually had some practice, obviously, at, at, at doing it um, from my experience of this game. Um, didn't seem to help um, any. <laughs> oh, that was stupid. Or certainly help a lot, anyway. Um, I was doing really, really well then, and, and uh, just uh, landed straight on a really quite simple, <laughs> simple icon. Yeah, once you kind of get the hang of the, of the patterns on this, it's not too bad. Although that wasn't very nice. Thank you for that. While I'm while I'm just uh, in the middle of saying you're not too bad and the, the patterns aren't too bad, <laughs> kind of throw that out at me. Oh, uh, that wasn't too nice either. But uh, got through it. There's just something about the music in this little bit either as well. It just kind of seem, makes it seem, I don't know, just slightly more epic. <laughs> no, don't lag. I really don't need lag. Doing good. Come on, nothing nasty in the last 10 seconds. That wasn't particularly nasty either, I just made a complete and total hash of it. With like five seconds left on the clock or something. Ugh. So I don't know I want to use it as, a, as an excuse, but I do seem to be picking up a little bit of a lag again at particular times, although as I say, it, didn't, it didn't affect the... Uh, I'm not going to certainly blame it for that last... But death at five seconds, because uh, no, that was just uh, that was just me messing up rather spectacularly. But uh, yeah, I do seem to be getting a little bit of lag now and then, which uh, is not helping any. Damn it! Yes, Boshy's uh, little exclamation there was uh, exactly what I was thinking. I do quite like that. It's another little nice little touch. Uh, the kind of little. Um, you know, things that uh, Boshy exclaims when he dies. I think he's got maybe about four or so different things that he says. I haven't really 
bother to count. That's really nasty. Count them, but uh, yeah, it's a nice little kind of uh, touch as well. Oh, uh, damn it, damn it, damn it. At the moment, I seem to be getting through the uh, really kind of uh, slightly annoying patterns that they're, that they're putting out, but uh, and then dying on the uh, more straightforward sections, which is ugh, starting to get annoying. As he's hitting that spike, that's uh, causing a real number of unnecessary deaths. But when you're trying to do a, a challenge to beat your previous um, previous run through, complete run through, just kind of all adds up in your mind. Don't like that. I'm actually slightly worried at this point in time because um, I've just realised that uh, if this is successful, <laughs> we'll be going past the. Uh, well, thankfully it wasn't going past the seven-minute mark, uh, which might have let either lost the footage. So uh, yeah, this is a good time to cut. Okay, well, it's back again. Let's get into this again. was nice of you. Well, in, in, well, nasty but nice at the same time. Oh, I knew I'd messed that up as well the second I even set off. Like I said, I just got through the, uh, what would look like a really, really nasty part and then got got on a comparatively easy bit. Ugh, that was dreadful. This uh, actually could uh, take me a while, so uh, apologies if this is getting a little bit repetitive. I'm usually a bit better, actually. Um, <laughs> I, say, I, I do, I do, it, it, I do quite like the segment, actually. So um, it's not too uh, annoying. Certainly, perhaps not as annoying as some of the sections in the Cheetah Men uh, level would be, had I not actually managed to somehow get through them quite uh, quickly. The uh, yeah the uh, the arrows uh, section and the red dot section in those two levels and uh, and indeed lacquer two which can be quite random are particularly that was really 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 nasty thanks for that um c uh, yeah can take a, a, an enormous amount of time so to get through those as quickly as I did um, this is now actually uh, taking a lot longer <laughs> than those um, but believe me far less irritating still despite the length of time I'm spending on it. Maybe it's even the music that uh, plays a factor in that. Not that the cheat I dislike the cheat of him music or anything, but uh, let's I say, let's do something about this music. level rising ever so slightly uh, no lag thank you
so, so much for that pattern. Don't lag. Please stop lagging. Come on. Yes, come on. Yes! Right, now, that m I think that will be it, but uh, we have to be very careful here. There's a rather irritatingly placed spike here. You also want to drop down um, to, uh, and hug the kind of right hand wall there so it's not to land on a spike. Um, and uh, yeah, just kind of be careful um, as, you're, as you're kind of doing this, as you're kind of going through there, particularly having, having um, gone through a minute of all that. Oh, uh, and uh, yeah, as I say, finally the uh, World 4 clear thing appears. And uh, we've got a little bit of time, so uh, yeah, why not? Let's check out the boss. Yes, it's Bialante, who is actually uh, really quite simple, he says, hopefully, that he doesn't bad thing, that he does really does not die over and over again, um, and fun. Um, when you're not falling into pits. Um, right, since I don't want to do that uh, uh, annoying uh, spike jump again, um, let's just uh, do a double check. Yeah, the, the boss, uh, the teleporter for boss four is open, so uh, let's save that there. Um, and we're approaching the seven minute mark, so um, I think we'll probably call that uh, probably call that a video. So uh, yeah, we're at uh, we're at uh, boss of world four. Uh, we're making very very decent progress. So uh, yeah, this has been. Uh, I want to be the boshi. Uh, again, I'm kind of struggling on the part. <laughs> <laughs> I really should, I really should learn to keep track. It's very difficult actually when you're kind of cutting halfway through and kind of piecing together, piecing together videos. But uh, yeah, it's been on Bosch, I want to be Boshy some kind of part, and uh, hope to see you again next time.